This is a professional MMA coach, and he's going to train me like a UFC fighter for a day. Mixed martial arts is one of the most dangerous sports in the world, with an injury rate of nearly 50%. Not to mention that mastering a martial art can sometimes take a lifetime. This got me thinking. How would someone like me do in the octagon? Can someone with subpar athletic ability keep up with the professionals? To answer this question, I'm going to train with a professional MMA fighter for a day. But there's only one problem with that. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've never been in a fight before. Yeah, that problem. Luckily, I know some guys who can help. I'm here at Anaceti Training Club in Las Vegas. Joining me is one of the owners and personal trainers, Val. This is Val. Val is a four-time national champion in wrestling, a professional mixed martial artist, and could probably kick my ass on a daily basis. For someone like me who has never fought before, what martial art would you recommend beginning on? Um, for MMA specifically, I, had, I think wrestling is a huge basic like foreground that you gotta start. Obviously, you need to know how to strike, you know how to punch, but if you don't know how to grapple, you can't just stand there and punch guys without defending legs. How long does it usually take for someone to become a black belt in a martial art? Um, I would say, like, let's say, like jujitsu. <clears throat> I know some guys that have taken them 20 years to get a black belt. As long as you keep training and keep trying to improve every day, that's kind of on you on how you excel. What would you say is the most important skill to have when training in martial arts? Um, the more, more hard work, hard work. I mean. At the end of the day, hard work's gonna beat talent all day, you know? Uh, you can't just be talented and not put in hard work. So I would say, personally, if you can work hard and you're coachable, you could pretty much do anything you want. Lastly, do you think I can become a master of martial arts in a day? I, I wouldn't say a master. And with that being said, we got to work. With no prior fighting experience and only an hour to work with, Val taught me three basic wrestling moves. The drop step, the single leg takedown, and the sprawl. In an MMA setting, we'd be like here, bam, you know, fighting or whatever. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna take me out. <laughs> <laughs> All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lower my level, and I'm just gonna go, bam, put my head right in the chest. And then you're gonna take him back. Anything yeah. you can to make me immobile to a point to where you can start using your offense on me. Okay. Is that black leg move realistic? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, I don't. <laughs> Feeling good about my new moves, I thought I was ready to spar with Val for real. Yeah, I wasn't. But it got me thinking. Could I survive a one minute round with a professional mixed martial artist? Having trained only a day, how would I look against someone who's trained for over 20 years? And with that being said, I challenge Val to a fight. Before this video continues, I have a goal of hitting 10,000 subscribers by June 1st. So if you like the content you see and want to see more, go down, like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. Also, ding the bell so you don't miss a single upload. Alright, back to the video. Alright gentlemen, I want a good clean fight. Get to your sides. Ready? 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 Fight! Get the, get the 
hope she doesn't know. I lost. But if this experience has taught me anything, it's that mixed martial arts isn't about how hard you're hit, but it's about how hard you hit back. This sport is grueling. To master it, you need to be as mentally strong as you are physically strong. But yeah, it hurt like a bit. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode. A huge thanks to Val and Napoleon of Anacetti Training Club for allowing me to film this video. If you want to show them some love, all their social medias are going to be linked down below in the description. Make sure to follow me and all my social medias right here. If you have a profession or skill you want me to learn next, leave it down in the comment section. Drink lots of water, and I'll see you next time. Good shit.